Hi, I'm Chas with Chas's Crazy Creations, and today I'm going to take some candle holders that I found at a thrift store for free and upcycle them into some beachy candles for my home. Let's get started. I found these two candle holders in a box outside a thrift store that said free. I had to grab them and bring them home with me because I just knew I could upcycle them for my home. I started by taking my Black & Decker Orbital Sander and sanded down the old paint and finish off of the candle holders so that I'd be able to paint them or stain them in a color that I desired more. Here are the candle holders after I finished sanding them. There are a few colors still in there that I just couldn't quite get out, but overall I'm very pleased with the way I was able to remove all the previous color. I love the beautiful look of the wood on its own, and I just wanted to do a little something more for the summer. I started with my Folk Art Home Decor Wood Tint in the color Cascade to get started with my smaller candle holder. I started by painting the wood tint onto the smaller candle holder and letting it soak in. I love this wood tint. It comes in a variety of colors and it's water soluble. Once I was done painting, I took a dry paper towel and wiped off the excess. I opted to do half of the candle holder at a time. So once the first half was done, I started in on the second half, painting on the wood tint and then wiping it off with a dry paper towel. Once I got done with the dry paper towel, I was afraid that there was maybe a little too much blue for my liking. So I got a old rag, a washcloth that I had, and got it wet and wiped at it a little bit more. This gave it the look I wanted. Now it was time to start on the second candle holder and I used Folk Art Home Decor Wood Tint in the color gray. I did the same process as the first time. I painted on the gray color and I did about half of the candle holder at a time. Once I got it painted on, I used a dry paper towel to wipe off the excess. I let both candle holders dry and I was surprised at how subtle the color had settled in after I wiped them off with a damp cloth. Overall, I'm pretty pleased with how these turned out. I like the subtle look and I was going for a beachy theme and I feel like this hit the mark. I'm able to use real candles or battery operated candles in these, which I love. I hope this inspires you not to pass up something that's free and turn it into something beautiful for your home. I'd love it if you'd subscribe to my YouTube channel and my blog. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in my next video.